Welcome to Dose of Drawing. In this video, I will show you how to draw Weedle. Through the video, I'm going to leave a small image of Weedle at the corner as a reference. Alright, let's get started by drawing a circle. This circle that we are drawing right now represents Weedle's head. At the middle of the head, on the left side, I'll be drawing the nose. As you can see, I'm drawing an oval shape. After drawing the nose, I will be moving on drawing the eyes. Starting from here, above the nose, on the left side, I'm drawing a very small circle. And giving space in between at, towards the middle of the head, I'm drawing another circle. At the top of the head, a little above the eyes, I'm drawing the singer of Weedle. So I drew a curved line at the bottom and connecting it to make a triangle or a cone shape. Next, we're going to move on to draw the body of Weedle. From here, I'm drawing a small curve. And moving over here, I'm drawing another curve to fill in to draw in a circle. Alright, once we're done drawing that circle, I'm going to start drawing guidelines of the body of Weedle. So from this side at the right of the body, I'm drawing a curve, and on the left side, I'm drawing another curve. I'm drawing guidelines because it helps me draw Weedle, or any kind of drawing that I'm doing. So as you can see here, I'm drawing the tail, or the outline of tail, so I'm connecting the lines to curve it all the way to make the shape of the tail. Hopefully drawing this outline or guideline will help you through the process of drawing Weedle. Alright, once we're done drawing the guideline, we're gonna move on to drawing the bodies. As you can see at the corner, Weedle has about 7 circles. So, right now I'm drawing the second circle using the guidelines that we just drew. So as you can see here, I'm using the guidelines drawing the circle staying inside the lines drawing two curves at the sides and connecting it together to fill in to make it to a circle. For the remaining parts of Weedle's body, I'm just going to put it into a time lapse. On this part, I'm drawing the last circle, which is the seventh circle of Weedle's body, and just connecting it all together. From here, I'm drawing the second stinger of Weedle. I drew a small curve at the bottom, and giving a little space, I'm drawing a curve again, and connecting it out to make the second stinger. We're almost done drawing Weedle. All we have to do is just draw its feet. So from here, aligning to the eye, I'm drawing a small circle. And moving on the next eye, aligning it to it, I'm drawing at the corner or at the side, another circle. As you can see right below the first feet, we're going to draw another circle. Moving 
to the left side we're going to draw another circle aligning it to it and we're just going to repeat the same process for the other feet of Weedle. At this part I'm going to put into time lapse to draw the rest of Weedle's feet. At any time in the video you can pause it to follow along or if I'm going too fast you can still pause it to complete the drawing of Weedle. Once you're drawing this last circle for Weedle's feet, you're all done drawing Weedle! For the rest of the video, I'm going to show a time lapse of my outlining and coloring Weedle.